Hey, what's going on, y'all? So, you know, as you can see, it is three, just about three thirty in the morning, and uh, I just don't feel sleepy. So, cause I, I gotta, I mean, my mind is churning, boy. But um, in this video, I wanted to talk about now is the key. Um, to master minimalism okay now that y'all see that people is panicking over toilet paper and uh that corona and that um if you look into certain rest uh not restaurants if you look into certain stores like Walmart, you'll see that a lot of the food is starting to run out. Or they're giving the illusion that the food is running out. Okay? And just a little side note, there's no need to panic. Okay? I would watch out more for the people and their emotions rather than there being a food scarcity. Because, um... What's going on is that people are focused more on the processed foods instead of the fresh foods. So with fresh foods, you they can't sit on the shelf all the time. So they've been decre decreasing the amount of uh, the fresh foods that they bring in. Okay. Um, and they had to throw a lot of that stuff away. And then people started realizing, oh, maybe we should get some meat or a little bit of vegetables. Uh, so that's what's happening there. But the reason that's part of the reason why you want to focus on it now, because as y'all can see right now, and I already saw this uh, coming. Um, you want to focus on trying to not be flashy okay start to set you up some passive incomes all right i told you all about how to get passive uh income through monetized youtube channels um what's another thing you got podcasts uh, uh app called anchor that's one you guys can use um like online digital things okay and then uh once you got that in play you could focus on minimalizing your lifestyle so like say f for me for instance i don't have an apartment apartment right now Okay, that's because I'm being shown how little I can operate off of, you know what I'm saying? And when I do feel it's time to get an apartment, when I have that, I'm not going to need as much as I felt that I needed before, okay? And basically, when it comes to minimalizing your lifestyle down, that's, you know, your car, you know, don't have a high car note. Um, there's no reason for all that. Um, like I have a um, GMC Safari, as you guys saw. And the reason I like and got the GMC Safari because it could serve multiple pers uh, purposes, okay? Instead of just buying a regular, regular vehicle. And I was able to buy it cash so I don't have to worry about spending money down the road, okay? Just only on maintenance, all right? And that's another thing. I'm able to provide better maintenance for the vehicle instead of my money going to a car note for that car. All right, so the car lasts longer. Mm -hmm. um, 
And then when it come to clothes and stuff like that, the reason why I'm part of the reason why I'm always telling you guys about um building your body is so you look better in regular clothes. Cause I I get my clothes from Walmart, man. I get my clothes from Walmart. Uh, I get my work shoes from Walmart. Now my step out shoes when I'm stepping out and showing out, you know, I still wear my uh, good shoes, like Nike, Adidas, Jordans, and things of that nature. Okay, that's what I personally like to do. Um, and that still keeps the cost of wardrobe low. And then when it comes to food, you already know that um, I have a a system as far as how much I spend on food a day. So five dollars and under as far as when it comes to a pound of meat, because uh, I like to focus on protein. Um, cause that's what maintains the body the best, or at least in my experience with the people, what, with what I seen with me and what I seen with other people, uh, when you compare in plant-based and meat-based, which plant-based is the majority of people, or you can also call it carb-based. All right. So that's how I structure my diet as far as that and then what else what else can i tell you guys i want to make sure i don't leave nothing out i think that's pretty much it so um those are you know some basics that you can use and just trying to put some on your noggin to help you think about how you're living your life and how you can minimize it down. And this is ultimately to have, um, keep more of your money. All right. The whole goal is to keep more of your money. All right. Um, and then when you keep your, when you keep more of your money, you don't want your money to sit. You want it going out to investing in the things that you're trying to do or get. Okay preferably things that's going to bring money back okay so when so you save six hundred dollars from practicing more minimalism in your life you don't want to just sit and stack on that six hundred dollars you always want to have a cushion okay but once you once you got that cushion go ahead start putting them the rest of that money into um like what I like to do is put it into promoting my channel. Um, the other things is precious metals. What other things do I like to do? Um, business endeavors, so starting LLCs, um, business bank accounts, um, and things of that nature. But in these times, I'm not too sure about starting a business banking account because anything can happen with these banks right now. Um, but yeah, I hope that helped as far as uh, getting your mind right about minimalism and how to implement it in your life. Because um, I'm pretty much doing that right now. Um, I'm in a period of life where uh, I'm enjoying some isolation, okay? The only time I, I'm around people is when uh, I'm at work, okay? And, you know, as a life path seven, we <laughs> it's crazy how much we enjoy uh, isolation, like being in this situation with somebody else they would go crazy all right but enough about all that man y'all have a good one uh thanks for subscribing liking the videos um i got stuff in the description box y'all should check out and y'all have a good one peace